Hi, it's Dave Gallant from MacObserver.com. Today we're going to be discussing whether or not BeeJive IM for the iPhone is worth the $9.99 purchase. When I purchased this a few months ago, it was $15, so I'm glad to see that the price has been reduced. But we're going to discuss whether or not it's worth paying $10 to use a free service like Instant Messenger. Here we are opening up BeeJive IM on my iPhone 3GS. I have both uh, Google Mail, Gmail, Gchat, whatever you prefer to call it, and AIM mapped on here. I found that Facebook chat, which I use a lot on my computer with ADM, is not working well with this. I believe it's Facebook's fault, but I'm not going to confirm that yet. So here we are in the chat. Um, very straightforward AIM chat, like the rest. Uh, first demo I'm going to show you is the push notifications, which is the biggest reason why you should buy this program. It was the first to launch push notifications well and um, going to demonstrate it. There we go, that was instantaneous. You heard me typing and you saw from my other screen name on my laptop next to me the notification. I hit view, it opens up AIM, and there's the message. Hi. Send another message, here you go. Hello. And almost instantaneous, this is connecting. Uh, keep in mind this is traveling over the, the cloud, over the internet. I am using my laptop on Wi-Fi in my house and the phone is over the 3G connection. We will work through a few of the um, the settings here on the, the B-Jive IM application. Um, back to the push. You have two choices. You can push over email or push over... There we go. Funny focusing. Uh, or push over the, the Data Connect. Uh, I found that the Data Connect push is in fact destroying my battery life, so I would not suggest keeping it on all day. But if you need it and it's important and you don't mind risking battery because you can keep it plugged in, then it's totally worth it. Back to the program itself. You have your list of favorites, which I don't use. Chats uh, it can be removed very quickly, which is nice to, to keep everything organized. This does in fact get very cluttered, I found. Um, you can have different uh, statuses for the different accounts, which is nice. And then also you can do different sorting, which I think the other programs lack, is the ability to sort well. I was a mobile chat user for a little while, if you remember the mobile chat incident, uh, but I jumped right back to BeeJive. Um, also while we're on here, I'm going to send myself a message to get the screen name to pop up. When in here, there are a few features you can use, such as sending a photo which is great. Sending a text copy of the chat. So if you wanted a copy of the chat they were using on your iPhone while you were out, and if you're used to having chats on your computer, you can actually send a .txt file to yourself or to anyone else. You can also do a voice recording. I've never used this yet, but it looks like it's recording, and we'll see what happens. Send. Looks like it's connecting. See, the, the features are just very, very straightforward, and it's great. And now on my computer. I just received a chat message right there from DJ David Gallant, my other screen name, saying that it has received a link. And, of course, the reason why you're paying for BeeJive is because you're paying for the servers, and you can see it's a link at BeeJive. So, back to the demo. I guess I should discuss the servers for a second. The reason why BeeJive costs $10 is because you are in fact paying for a server. When you log out of BeeJive, out of the app, the app is obviously not working anymore. And say you drop network connection, you're out in the woods, you're out in New Hampshire for example, and you lose your 3G access. What's nice about this program is the server will store all of your messages for a period of, you can do 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, up to 24 hours, all your messages will be cached on the server, similar to the way that Sidekick used to do their AIM, which they had partnered with AOL, to organize the, the chats and basically give you an outage-free experience, which is the reason why I paid the $10. The AIM version, I believe, can do up to 24 hours, but it's not as good, it's not as stable. Um, the support from BeeJive is awesome. There's a great forum they have, uh, support at BeeJive.com, I believe. Uh, you can find it on their site. They also do lots of feedback. I talked to them on Twitter. Uh, very, very great experience. So once again, this was BeeJive IM. Quick walkthrough for MacObserver.com.